In the harbor towns along Lake Michigan, there haven't been a lot of good fish stories to tell. The last couple of years, the fishing has been pretty bad. Yeah, a little bit, but this spring, the salmon are back. 24 Albert News 8's Ken Kolker spent the night along the big lake in Grand Haven. What we have here is a fish story with a news hook. After two really bad years, the king has returned, especially here in Grand Haven. Hi, there we go. Wow. I've been doing this, uh, running trips out of Grand Haven since 84, and this is by far probably our best uh, salmon fishery we've had now in quite a long time. The DNR confirmed it. The salmon fishing's been strong up and down Lake Michigan from St. Joe to Frankfurt. This is king salmon right here. But the DNR says they're really biting in Grand Haven. Grand Haven has been on fire. It, it really has. It's been on fire. It's good news for charter boat captains and for harbor towns. The restaurants, the motels, the, the fuel stations, and the shopping centers, the downtowns, um, all benefit by this sort of activity. In 2015 and 16, Chinook or King Salmon in Lake Michigan dropped to levels not seen since the 1970s. Last year, the DNR says an estimated 1.1 million king salmon swam the lake, yeah, far buddy. below average. This year, though, they expect that number has almost doubled to nearly 2 million, closer to average. Yeah! But average is a far cry better than what it's been. And it's just not Grand Haven. It's, it's from, you know, St. Joe all the way up to Manistee, uh, Coho and Chinook salmon. Thanks in part to a couple of warm winters that allowed the salmon's food supply, the alewives, to thrive. I can't recall seeing it last this strong this long in this area of the lake. And that's tonight's fishing report. In Grand Haven, Ken Colker, 24 Hour News 8.